Hi guys, Nick Miller here today from Mark Supply Company. They have for you a 2014 Bobcat T650 rubber track skid steer loader. This is a interim tier four. This would be the very last with a Kubota motor that would have been built with no admissions. Um, actually, this would be a voucher machine where Bobcat had some vouchers from the EPA and they had extra motors because um, there was 14 models that had the uh, Dusan engine in it. Uh, this is a Kubota. Uh, this machine is loaded up very nice. Cab heat air, power attach, uh, roller suspension, brand new wide track, 18 inch wide tracks on it. Uh, very nice running working machine with 2,280 hours. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start you back here at the engine compartment take completely around this machine. Back door is in good shape. Uh, down here in the back bumper there is a couple little dings. Let everybody to see that. We did paint the back door. Um, the back pillars here we did paint. They were scuffed up, put new decals on. And up on the front of the loader arms there's been some touch up. The rest of the white paint is original. And we'll go through and show you all of that. Powered by a Kubota V3307T, uh, four-cylinder turbo diesel engine, that's 74 horsepower engine. Uh, starts and runs excellent, there's no abnormal noise, smoke, blow by, anything of that nature. Been in the shop, serviced engine oil, fuel, hydraulic, charge fan filter, cartridge filter up here um, in the uh, hydraulic compartment. In there is your air conditioning condenser, radiator, and hydraulic cooling package. What I like about these pre-admissions machines, that was the last of the super, super good ones. Uh, you're not going to find um, that stuff out on the market a whole lot anymore. It's getting harder to find every day. I can't come up with it. Um, this is the only one I have right now that has a Kubota motor in it. And this stuff, like I said, is getting harder and harder to find. So, back door does shut good. Again, we painted this pillar here. And all this is original here. And when you come down the loader arm, we did actually cut this in and painted the front corners. They were just chipped up. Undercarriage. We put brand new tracks on from our friends down at Summit Supply. If you need tracks, give them a call. And only a guy that's a hack doesn't do this. We put brand new sprockets on with brand new tracks. That's how it should be. We see guys all the time put new tracks on and they have a set of sprockets for 40%. Brand new sprockets, brand new tracks, both sides match. Roller suspension, all the leaf springs are in excellent condition. We went ahead and did the hub oils. They've both been changed both sides. We did the canister filter in here uh, for the charge fan. There's no leaks on any cylinders. All the glass is in the cab. It comes with a light new. There's a couple of things up here in the top of it. It has light new, all new teeth on it. Cutting edge is beautiful. Uh, side cutters are on the bucket. 80 inch. Bobcat, heavy duty, high capacity tooth bucket for a track loader. Uh, very, very nice bucket, and it is an OEM Bobcat. Coming up front, power quick attach. Uh, quick attach itself is very good and tight. Auxiliary hydraulic, seven pin attachment control device, and case drain. See the other side matches the other side. New sprocket, new track, roller suspension. Again, all the leaf spring rollers are in very good condition. Cabin door is in very good shape. The only thing we have ordered here I'm waiting to come in is a wiper blade I need to put on yet. And other than that, uh, door is complete. Wiper, washer, everything works. Take you inside here and show you some stuff. There is a little wee bit of concrete spatter on the front right here on the inside of the loader arm. Seat is in good condition. There is something, honestly, they had something in their pocket or what. They made a couple little marks there, but it didn't warrant putting the seat in it. Go through the display here. No active warnings. Vitals. 2,280 hours. RPM bolts. No codes. That's nice. Wiper, washer, wiper, cab heat air, all works. New cabin filters. We'll go ahead and turn this back over. We're going to go ahead and fire this machine back up. We're going to run around and show it does everything it's supposed to do. I'll even illustrate that the parking brakes work. 
you put vinegar in the pile so you can see it push and uh, take the bucket on and off. Here we go.
the video. This 2014 Bobcat T650 runs and works very nice. Um, ice cold air, cab heat air, power attach, keyless dash, roller suspension, 18 inch wide tracks, brand new, brand new sprockets both sides. Uh, really, really a nice running working machine with the Kubota uh, V3307T, 74 horsepower uh, turbo diesel engine. Um, if you want to combine and see this machine yourself in person, I have absolutely nothing to hide. Come on and do it. It's why we take the time to work them in the dirt pile, show you everything is the way it's supposed to be. It's why we take the time to show you quick tatch, everything like that works. Um, it's just part of what we do here. So if you have any question on this loader at all, 814-658-3066. Please check our website, www.marksupplyco.com. Please understand, I price my stuff right. The problem is right now, I can't find good track loaders. Um, this is the last track loader we just got ready to go. It's the last one I have left. Um, track loaders are selling and I can't replace them. I don't know where I'm going to find them. They're just not out there. Uh, there's a lot of junk in the market. You go watch what you're buying, but very good running working machine. If a guy won't take the time to do a video like I do, he's hiding something. So if you got any questions, 814-658-3066. 2014 Kubota. Uh, Pre-admissions with 2280 hours. Cab heat, air, power attach, wide track, roller suspension ready to rock and roll. Any questions? Again, I'm Nick Meller, 814-658-3066. As always, thank you very much for checking out Mark Supply Company. Have a great day.